Hello everyone, welcome to another video. In this video, I will show you how to use ChatGPT AI to create a WordPress website. Now, as you can see, we already created some uh, really great structure to our website. Now, what I did is I inputted create a website with navigation bar and footer. And as you can see, I got the HTML. So first, ChatGPT told me that I will need to use HTML CSS and JavaScript. So HTML, as you can see, it gave me a code for HTML. Then it gave me a code for footer. And then as you can see, that's pretty much it, right? You have CSS, HTML, and then he, it says in JavaScript, you can add functionality to the navigation bar, such as drop down menu or active states for the links. And you can pretty much see where I'm getting from. So basically what you can do is you cannot actually say ChatGPT to code you an entire WordPress website. So what you actually need is you need to know how your WordPress website is going to look like, how your navigation bar is going to look like, how your footer is going to look like, how your body is going to look like, right? So let's say I know how my footer is going to look like. And what I can do is I can say, create me a uh, navigation bar. Let's say navigation bar, not footer. Um, that is dark gray with, uh, with, uh, that, that, that is dark gray and, and sticky, sticky on scroll. Also add menu, menu to it as well. And we can do something like add, add menu to it and make it responsive. So let's see what ChatGPT can uh, can do this. So as you can see, here's an example of a navigation bar that is dark gray, sticky on scroll and responsive. As you can see, first it's writing out the HTML code, right? And obviously the navigation bar, the color, uh, which is dark gray, color here of the uh, font, positioning, which is sticky, top Z index as well, uh, menu, display, right? So this is CSS by the way, all of it is CSS except this one, this is HTML. And then that's pretty much it as you can see. Uh, now it's writing out the, the menu. So we have home, about, contact, uh, button class, stuff like that, right? Uh, which is really, really amazing if you see it. So uh, what, I, what my point with this video is, is basically that you can code the entire website, but you will need to know which elements on the website you need. For example, I needed a a navigation bar. So that's what I put in, right? And now when I need uh, basically navigation bar, I can go here and I can just put it here and it will basically spit out the navigation bar and how to use it. As you can see, now it is basically function to make navigation bar sticky on scroll. As you can see, this is, uh, I think, JavaScript and CSS. So it's, it's still writing guys. I mean, this is crazy, right? So as you can see, that's how you can uh, pretty much uh, you know, create a website, right? In chat with chat GPT, actually. Now this is just one simple uh, example, right? And it's not even simple, as you can see, it has a lot of it, right? Um, but you can, you get the point, right? Um, so yeah, this is basically it. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you have any questions or comments, comment down below and uh, we'll see you in the next video. Thank you guys for watching.